Hey, Dark Star here for Doc Sports, and today is May the 21st and on a Tuesday, and I'm back with more free plays for you. Yes, uh, more free plays for you today. Yesterday went one and one, should have gone to uh two and oh. The Yankees had a four to one lead going into ninth. Uh Clay Holmes, one of the best closers in baseball, had nothing yesterday. Seattle scored four times and won the game five to four. Right pick, wrong result. Simple as that. So I'm not gonna uh, can't can't do anything about that. Just the it was there. West Coast Wives guys was right. Okay, so West Coast Wives guys now I think twenty one and eleven sounds right. I believe or maybe even twenty two and eleven. I'm twenty seven and fifteen on recent uh, free play. So let's get that two and zero going today instead. All right. So that's that's what the mission is on the video today is it's to get you uh, two more winners and that we're looking to uh, nail that down. Uh, Today, uh, ready to go with more hot action, Major League Baseball. I have a six-unit best bet, as you can see here on the screen. Major League Baseball hit a seven-unit on Saturday uh, on a 60% run overall in Major League Baseball. So today, coming back with a six-unit best bet, which is part of a three-play package. So you can get all three plays for just 30 bucks, including that six-unit best bet at the Doug Upson page at Doc Sports. So make sure that you check that out. Yesterday, the six unit winner or the six unit play was a winner that I had a major league props. I had Reed Detmers to go under uh, 17 and a half innings or 16 and a half. I think it was 16 and a half. 16 and a half innings, and he uh, only made it to 12, gave up six runs. Okay. Angels came back to win the game, surprisingly enough. But the uh, but that was an easy winner in the six unit play. So if uh, any of you made that purchase, I thank you for that. And so it was, it was a nice day. For that. And today, so I'm coming right back with another prop play, not a best bet, but another prop play. And that raised yesterday's win, raised my record back to 60% on prop since December. And we'll look to like to add one more to that tonight with that. Also, then finally, in uh, NBA, the conference finals startup, Pacers and Celtics. And I have the ATS winner for that particular game. It's available at the Doug Upstone page at Doc Sports. All right, so got a, got a lot of good stuff there got going there off a nice two in one day. So let's just let's just looking to keep adding to it. And now I mentioned my records uh, on the free play videos. Make sure that you sign up at, at the Doc's uh, Doc's page here or the Doc's YouTube channel and get yourself free picks. Okay, you can get it from me and get it from any of the guys. Okay, that are doing videos. Uh, and my record speaks for itself, as I mentioned already. So make sure that you sign up, get these free picks, and then go into your settings and hit that alert bell. And that alert bell will alert you to the fact that anytime I do a video, you can watch it right then because it's done. So make sure that you do that. All right, let's talk some free play baseball for today. Is that I'll admit it, okay, I was befuddled by the line on Kansas City and Detroit. Okay, for this AL Central showdown, um, I you know it's one of these games that yeah you look at and you say, geez, this 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 looks too easy." Okay, and often it is too easy, and you lose. But this one just I I don't know. So, so I'm gonna I'm gonna give the bet the odds makers a benefit of the doubt. And I've seen some other uh, let's just say uh, AI generated material out there to where. Uh, kind of favoring Detroit in this one. Now, I got a line of 105. So basically the game, when, when I did this, it was basically an even game at, at minus 105 for both teams. I saw just before I started doing the video, there's been a little bit of Kansas City action in this one. And I think it's justified. Okay, Kansas City, Kansas City has the superior record between the two teams, has the better offense, 4.7 uh, run, runs per game versus 4.2, is better at run prevention, 3.4 versus 3.9. Um, the starter for the uh, Royals is Alec Marsh. Uh, Marsh and the Royals this season combined with the, with their uh, their records six and one. Casey Mice for Detroit, good five and three, but five and three is not six and one. And Marsh has a noticeably lower ERA, even though um, uh, the uh, uh, ERA for Mice is good. It's 2.43 versus 3.50. Detroit has a good road record, 13 and 11. But when you compare that record to Kansas City's at home, where they're 19 and 8 at the K and 13 and 3 at home, if they're off a home win like they are off, off of Detroit last night, geez, that seems to benef benefit them. Finally, with the totals at nine. Okay. And when that, that seems to perfectly fit. 
the uh, situation with Marsh and the Royals because Marsh and the Royals are six and zero oh this season when the total is between eight and a half and six. Okay, so I think you figured it out by now. I am taking Kansas City on uh, the money line tonight over the Detroit uh, Tigers on this one. Got a jet flying overhead, so that's why uh, a, a fighter jet. They come around here all the time, so that's what all that noise is. So, anyways, Kansas City Royals play. Okay, so we have that. So, again, six-unit best bet going to Major League Baseball, part of a three-play package for just 30 bucks at the Doug Upson page at Doc Sports. MLB prop, looking for another winner, improved that 60% record since December. And Celtics, Pacers, ATS winner goes tonight. Okay, at my page also. West Coast Wise Guys play for day. A little bit different, but the uh, one of the top guys in props, and it turns out uh, three other people also had exactly the same prop, and that is to go to take under on the uh, Guardians, Carlos Carrasco. So under 17 and a half outs for Carlos, Carlos Carrasco. He hasn't been particularly effective, and he's in the latter stages of his career. So the thought here is that he's just not going to get it done. So there you have it for a Tuesday. I'm ready to go. So I will be back, of course, then on Wednesday, and we'll see if we can do this all over again. And uh, hey, by, and by the way, while I'm while I'm thinking of it, uh, the there's been a lot of uh, t- uh, discussion I, I have read on the total for tonight's Boston uh, Pacers game tonight. So if you like some, if let me know what your feelings are on the total over or under. Okay, Wh- whatever you think on that game. So this is Doug Upshaw for Doc Sports. Until next time, I'm out. <laughs>